feminism has become something of a dirty word in certain circles. Now some of you are most likely wondering how I managed to get this video. Simple, I recorded it using my video editor. Now let's get to the bottom of this. I have voices in my head, they counsel me, they understand. I find it rather interesting that feminists are so confused on why there are people avoiding the word feminism. If these feminists actually spend more than an hour with someone who's against feminism for quite some time, they might actually understand why people like myself oppose feminism. But let's be honest with ourselves. No feminist is going to go on a limb and do some research, especially if they're female, because female feminists will tend to use their gender as some sort of defense for the white knights to be in. Lately, a lot of high-profile women like Shailene Woodley, Meryl Streep, and Marion Cotillard have gone on record saying they are not feminist. I really like the last one. Marion Cotillard has lost her damn mind. She's not a feminist. Oh, what a sad day to be a feminist. We must cleanse her soul. There's even a group called Women Against Feminism. But what are these women really saying when they declare they aren't feminist? That these people do not want to be in a group that uses dogmatic principles and has the same mentality as that of a cult? What they think they're saying is, I don't hate men, I love men. I don't think women are better than men. I'm not that kind of woman. You know, the crazy, bra-burning, feminazi kind. Yes, once again we have this straw man argument about how these people who oppose feminism just think feminism is about man-hating because they are told that there are a bunch of man-haters. This shit is getting quite annoying already. You may not be a broad burning lesbian who hates men, but you are a bitch who wants to control how reality should work. I'm a cool woman. I don't want to put women above men. Yeah, I may be a member of the Ku Klux Klan, but I'm one of those cool people you can trust. I'm a fun person who doesn't hate black people. I just identify as a member of the Ku Klux Klan. For anyone who needs a refresher, this is what feminism means at its core. Feminist. A person who believes in the social, political, and economic equality of the sexes. Again, these people are trying to justify on how feminism is all about equality just by using the dictionary definition. Yet this dictionary definition is not only flawed, but also doesn't really help explain the beliefs of feminism clearly, like for example the patriarchy. And feminists have, again, explained that you cannot be racist towards whites or sexist towards men because only the privileged can be racist and sexist. And this is part of the same group of people that is now defending pedophilia. Almost every social justice warrior is basically a feminist. Hating men and being a feminist are actually not connected at all. Not even a little bit. To call a man an animal is to flatter him. He's a machine. A walking dildo. Rape is nothing more or less than a conscious process of intimidation by which all men keep all women in a state of fear. I feel that man-hating is an honorable and viable political act. That the oppressed have a right to class hatred against the class that is oppressing them. I know that feminists love to play the not all feminist card then complain about how people like myself use the not all men card because let's face the facts, they understand that it's not all men who rape, but they're allowed to say it anyway because they are total assholes. There's a limit on how much you can pretend that some of the biggest people who has influenced feminism does not hate men, when in reality they do. Feminism is about equality of the sexes, but right now one sex has a lot more power than the other. I love my male privilege. More likely to die at my job and being screwed over when it comes to divorce courts. Got to love my male privilege. Men are not systematically oppressed based on their gender. It's not like men get their lives fucked up if they're accused of being a rapist even if he's innocent. And it's not like men are never once get abused by women. And that's a fact. But women are. And that's a fact too. Yes, it is a fact. And it should not be up to us to tell you that. Just listen and believe! So if you believe any of the following Reproductive rights Equal pay for equal work Seeing diverse bodies, ethnicities, and gender expressions on screen and in magazines Providing education to 62 million girls who don't have access to it That's pretty much the biggest overestimation I ever seen. Maybe this is a worldwide thing, which then I can maybe understand, but even then, it seems like you're just pulling this shit out of your ass.
Ending sexual violence. Having women in government, having women CEOs. If a woman does her job right, then I have no problem. But you're saying this in the sake of diversity and nothing more. It seems that America is the only place that needs diversity and every other country does not need it. Odd, if you think about it. You know, basic gender equality. Surprise, you're probably a feminist. You know, I can use your own logic against you. You believe in economic prosperity, right? And you believe that there should be 0% unemployed, right? Well, the Nazis are the ones who come up with this stuff, so I guess that makes you a Nazi. The hell! Feel free to identify or not identify any way you want. But if you say you're not a feminist, at least understand what the term actually means. Yeah, I already know the dictionary definition of feminism, so thanks but no thanks. I'd rather not be part of a stupid cult. And if you think that you're a humanist, Ziva, we gotta go. We just don't have time for this today. Oh no, I was very curious on what you have to say about humanism. I mean, what's wrong with being a humanist? Hell, I'm one and I also identify as an egalitarianist. But I guess all these videos is just a way to make a desperate plea to make feminism look like it's male friendly. So I'll be sharing the original video where you guys can download it so that way you can make a video response to it. I am the Atheist Gamer and keep gaming on.